Hey guys, two big updates are coming from Lucid's end. One is good and one is bad. But first, let's talk about the bad one. Lucid supplier Panasonic cut full air outlook as costly raw materials weigh. If raw material prices will rise, it will also impact Lucid Group. Japan's Panasonic Holding Corp cut its annual operating profit forecast by 12.5% on Thursday after lower than expected third quarter earning hit by headwinds from slowing global economy and persistently high raw material prices. The company faces challenges amid a tricky outlook for global growth as it looks to further build out its energy business which includes making auto batteries for electric vehicles like Lucid and Tesla. Panasonic said in presentation material it will aim to grow profit in automotive batteries by expanding sales of a 2170 model lithium-ion battery cells and commercializing the more advanced 4680 format battery. The company's energy unit last month signed an agreement with Lucid Group to supply lithium-ion batteries for EV makers' full lineup, including its air luxury model. These increased battery prices could hamper Lucid growth. However, the company is saying that they will make these type of batteries more, so I believe there won't be any supply chain issue. Another big update which is coming from Lucid's end is that ex JLR special vehicle boss will lead Lucid Group in Europe. Michael Van de Sande takes managing director position as luxury EV manufacturer begin their European expansion. Seems like Lucid is taking their European expansion very seriously. This is why they are hiring people from big companies. After China, Europe is the second largest EV market for EV manufacturers. If Lucid succeed in Europe, that market will add a big chunk of revenue in its balance sheet. With that said, thank you so much for being here. See you in next update.